formatting your Quora answers the right way. One of the greatest misses that aspiring Quora marketers fall into is not formatting their content the right way. This is a mistake that marketers on all platforms make at one point on all social media channels. But this doesn't have to happen to you. Because in this lesson, we are going to teach you how to give a very polished answer to your Quora questions. Using formatting tools. Most Quora users overlook the formatting and editing tools available when they compose their answers. Granted, most users are not using Quora to grow a presence, so they create simple, plain text answers that don't catch the eye. But if you take a close look at the top answers, you'll notice that all of them look very polished, and they read like something you'd find on a blog. This is because top contributors know how to format their answers in a way that makes them stand out. And it all comes down to using the formatting at your disposal when you click on Answer to open the editing window. Open with a headline. A very effective way to make your answers resemble a blog post is by adding a headline at the very beginning. The trick is to use a very direct and brief answer to the question and to bolden the text. Then you'll simply have to follow up with the longer answer. This has the effect of forcing readers to stop by when they see your answer. This also helps your answer stand out when you're not the first to reply, because of the same effect. Use spacing. Another way to make your answers look more attractive is by using spacing to mimic the textbook format. What you'll do is to separate your text into paragraphs. The length of each paragraph will vary according to the length of your answer. For instance, if you're giving a long-form answer, you should type the opening text into a paragraph and to develop the answer into a single, longer paragraph and then to close with a third, short paragraph. Your answers will look more organized this way and they'll read like an excerpt from a book. Use subheadlines. If you're composing an answer where you cover multiple ideas or topics, it is a good strategy to use a headline for each idea or topic you discuss. This is easy enough, and all you have to do is to compose a single line of text with the idea or topic keyword, to bolden it, and then to develop the idea below the headline. Using headlines will let you format your answers like list articles, which are easier to read than long-form articles with no subheadlines. Use italics and symbols when appropriate. It can be difficult to understand the whole context of an answer when you only use plain text. Because of this, it is necessary that you use italics and symbols such as quotes and symbols when appropriate. This will help you to highlight elements in your answers such as keywords, sentences, and to highlight names or citations. Use numbers and bullet points. Some answers will require you to list a certain number of points, and the Quora formatting toolbar lets you use numbers and bullets to create your lists. This will help you to keep your answers more organized and easier to read. Add an image at the top of your answers. You will find a media button in the answer toolbar that allows you to upload an image or video to your answers. We already showed you how to use this button to add images that enhance your answers. But a best practice that you can apply too is to insert an image at the top of your answer, right below the headline or below the first paragraph. This image will appear as a thumbnail when users see your answer in their feed increasing the visual appeal of your posts. Hyperlink to external sources. If you're including links to external sources, it is best that you hyperlink to them in your text than to include them at the end of the answer. What you have to do is to simply highlight the text that makes reference to the content in the link and to use the link button to insert the link right into the text. And that is it. Follow these simple formatting rules and you'll become a top contributor in no time.